A grim scene on an island where many had hoped to start a new life. A boat carrying hundreds of migrants from Africa sank as it tried to reach the Italian island of Lampedusa. As the ship started taking on water, the fuel started leaking. Being worried about what was happening, the crew and passengers set fire to a blanket so that they could be seen from passing ships and that caused a fire on board. When the fire started, they panicked and all moved to one side of the ship, causing it to capsize. Rescuers arrived at the scene in the early hours of the morning. More than 100 people were pulled from the waters and taken to shore. But it's believed 500 people were on board, including pregnant women and children. It's one of the deadliest boating accidents involving migrants and the second one this week. Italian ministers are calling for action. I have to ask for the shared intervention from the European Union to adopt humanitarian corridors, corridors that would make these trips safer, and to end trips in which criminals make money off the backs of men, women and children. Thousands of migrants from Africa arrive in Italy and Malta every year. Hundreds have been killed during the precarious journey. You have to think of the tragedy that lies behind this, which is that these people, many of them are likely to have been fleeing war, fleeing persecution, fleeing human rights abuses in their own countries. So this is a tremendous tragedy of multiple layers. But with the continuing unrest in North Africa, boatloads of migrants will still make the journey, despite the risks involved.